So how do you overcome Satan? How do you resist the devil? How do you resist temptation? In Revelation chapter 12, there's a story of some courageous believers that overcame Satan. And here's what the Bible says. They overcame him by the blood of the lamb and the word of their testimony, and they loved not their lives until the death. Number one, they overcame him by the blood of the lamb. What does that mean? That means that they recognized that their access to God was given to them not based on what they did for God, but based on what God did for him. The Bible says that we who were far off have been made near by the blood of Jesus. The Bible also says if we confess our sin, he's faithful and just to forgive us our sin and cleanse us from all unrighteousness. See, the devil will tempt us, will give in to the temptation, and then the devil will say, don't even think about going to God. That would be hypocritical. No, I have access to God's presence through the blood of the Lamb, meaning Jesus Christ died on the cross for me. He shed his blood for me, and that shed blood gives me the ability to approach God. They overcame him by the blood of the Lamb. Number two, by the word of their testimony. They spoke boldly about their faith. Listen, we all have a testimony. Our testimony is simply the story of what God has done for us, how we came to faith. You know, people can argue with what you say. They can argue with your theology, but they can't argue with your personal story. You're the greatest expert on you. And this is a great way to start a conversation. Tell someone what Jesus Christ has done for you. And lastly, they love not their lives until the death, which means these folks described in Revelation 12 knew that their life was in the hands of God. The Bible actually says our times are in his hands. Listen, stop worrying about how long you're going to live and focus instead on living well, living in a way that brings honor and glory to God. So one day we will hear him say, well done, good and faithful servant, enter into the joy of your Lord. He may give you 10 more days, 10 more years, or decades more But don't worry about that. That's in God's hands. So remember, you overcome Satan by the blood of the lamb, the word of your testimony, and they did not love their lives until the death. Something to think about.